Good day guys and welcome to part two of my playthrough. Alright, so um, we're on the mission to um, become relic hunters uh, with the museum in solitude. So we're just camping out here on the cliff as you do for the view of course. And I just want to check the lighting uh, with this new EMB, the picturesque EMB. I just want to see how dark it actually gets at night. Okay, so that's like 11.30. It's a little bit overcast. And yeah, it's pretty dark, so that's pretty cool. I'm happy with that. Alright, let's uh, get to bed. Get up early, 5.30. And it's raining. Of course it's raining. <laughs> Alright, just need to... Oh, there's a fire going. Wow, it's so dark I can't see. Destroy him. Alright, that is our camp all sorted. Wow, it is so dark. Let's just uh, lose another hour here. You know what I'm thinking. I just know I'm not going to make it though. Yeah, I'm just going to end up on the rocks. Alright, we'll try and go down the safe way. Wow, it's still so dark. I'm just going to give it another hour. Hey! Now I can actually see. Looks like a cliff that way. We'll just go right around. So I'm pretty sure this is uh, AMV rain, uh, which is turned on here. I'm just going to quickly check that. Um, yes, it is. Without it, well, it's not much change. So I've noticed um, with the newer AMVs, the uh, AMV rain's um, getting a lot better. It actually looks pretty good now. Uh, for a while there it was looking really dark, um, had like a black edge around it. Um, now it's looking um, um, a lot more realistic I think. And you can actually adjust it as well. Um, I haven't fiddled around with it at all. Uh, actually I haven't fiddled around with anything with this uh, EMB uh, at all. I haven't touched uh, one setting on it yet. And I actually don't think I will. I think I'll just leave it completely completely stock. Oh, 
headshot. Be pretty bad if I missed from there. It's a pretty nice um, wet effect too on the uh, rocks and the ground. It's actually really nice. I like it. Even the deer looks wet. Actually, how does my character look? Um, yeah, wet. Well, clothes anyway. Yeah, that's awesome. Well, I can't believe, can't believe I didn't spook that deer. I was getting pretty close. This guy doesn't look friendly. Thief assassin. Hmm, I could almost go a bit of shr shrouded armor. Um, yep, I'm going to take it. Probably should check my carry weight, actually. Okay, so I've only got um, 42 left. I better watch that. Oh my god, there's three deer there. Oh, that's going to be a tough shot. Damn it, he stopped. I think it was going to be low anyway. Oh my god, there's another one. Job's done. Now I've just got to work out how to get safely across there. I think that's the spot. I did shoot one up here, didn't I? Sure I did. Probably slid down actually. Maybe. Yes, there it is. Be able to make a lot of leather now. It's awesome. Well, wow, even the snow looks a little wet. That's cool. I'm heading the wrong way too, guys. <laughs> Just got a little bit distracted.
and awesome. Now it looks like we've got some good weather coming through. Ah, oh, the sun's even out. Yeah, so the plan is we're um, heading to the museum in Solitude and we're going to talk to the curator there because we uh, have found out that there's a position going for a relic hunter so we thought we might give that a, a crack and um, see how that goes. Oh, that's a long shot. Where are you going? Mm, that's a little far. Could be trouble up here. Oh, wrong button. Just gonna go for a quick save. Oh, one more. I see your way down there, buddy. Okay, I can't help feeling we got out of that quite lightly. It's a good thing. And we'll keep that for another day. I think we'll straight line it too. Damn, that was a little deeper than I was expecting. Oh, hello. Oh god, there's another one. Where is he? Ah, oh, damn, I hate spiders. Uh oh, that's gonna get me. Ouch. Wow, how's the effects on that? Couldn't see Squat there for a while. Ah, oh, he's in the water. It's so sneaky. Damn. Yeah, we'll take some venom. Why not? Uh, I don't think I'll loot the other one. Let's just push on. Hmm, I thought I saw you. I'm just going to hide behind the tree here. What? I didn't drop him in one shot. Oh god, he's getting close now. Ugh. Ugh. Give me the creeps. Yeah, got my arrow back. Bonus. how much I love this EMB slash weather combo. So yeah, I think I mentioned in the last uh, video, um, picturesque EMB, um, it's basically a weather mod and EMB together. Uh, it has two parts, so you don't need or you shouldn't have any other weather mod running when you use this because it um, has its own weather mod with the uh, AMB over the top of it and it is stunning wow
Alrighty, um, I really don't want to cross here. That's um, a fair way across and no doubt very deep. Um, just going to find somewhere a little bit safer. Wow, I don't know how that first one missed. And you know what? I think... No, actually, we'll use those rocks. We'll cross where the rocks are. Seems like a good plan. Oh. They bandits. I need to investigate. Surely they're not friendly. Let's just have a bit of a look. Oh yeah, bandits for sure. Uh. You've got no idea where I am. Uh. Oh, straight in the back. Nasty. And I don't think it's worth trying to get my arrows back. Just gonna leave them. Let's do this. <sighs> so obviously um, you can fiddle around with the uh, EMB settings for underwater and um, change all that. You can add tint, um, blur it up a bit more if you like as well. Um, I like how that looks just as it is so I'm just not going to touch it. Hey. That's uh, plenty of blur for me. It's got a slight blue tinge to it, so that's pretty much what I like. <sighs> wow, first time I've been to the sawmill with this character. Hey, dude. What do you want? Oh. This should be good. You know what? Never mind. I'll just uh, leave you to your sawmill, shall I? Oh my god, that's right, I need to get an axe. And a pick. I'd like to be able to just steal one, to be honest. But I'm thinking I'm probably going to have to buy one. Hello, fella! What's up? That was a guard, I'm pretty sure. Dude, can I have your axe? Here for work? Get an axe. Bring me all the wood you can chop. Yeah, that's why I'm here. I want your axe. Living outside the walls is a risk, aye. But 
At least the guards don't come nosing around. True, true that. All right, there might be one up here. I doubt it, but oh my god, oh my god. There's no one around. It's mine. Look at the strips. Can never have too many of those. Oh my god, that was perfect. I could even sharpen it up while I'm here. No, there's no time. So what I'll quickly do is um, just get some wood for my next uh, outing, my next camping trip. My overnighter. So I don't have to go searching for wood. Most likely in the dark. It's all coming together. Oh my god, there it is. It's on my backpack. How cool is that? I did not know that was going to happen. They say Alfred Stormcloak murdered the High King with his voice. No. Shouted him apart. Are you kidding me? That's incredible. Imagine having powers like that. So I wonder if I get a pick, if that'll be on my backpack as well. That would be too cool. I'm uh, really loving my new bow placement too. Except for the fact that it sort of goes through the backpack there. And would be near impossible to get on and off quickly. Uh, apart from that, I love it. Hello, orange child. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, level up, really? Let's just keep plugging it into health. Oh wow, level 7. This is awesome. And... No, that's right, we're going two-handed. Uh, two-handed do 40% more damage. And should I work on my block? I still can't do anything with light armor, I'm pretty sure. Actually, yeah, let's put um, this one into a block. So I'm being a little bit defensive at the moment. Stacking my points on health. Putting perks into block. <laughs> Just trying to minimize the times I die, really. I'm a little busy at the moment. I've got all sorts of errands to run. Oh, good for you. You were there for Rogvir's execution. Why do you want to rethink that? You're missing out on some people to see I'd and uh, places to go, mm, huh? I'd rather not Maybe. talk about it. Oh, wow. You see me when you get if you're heading to the training again. Palace, you might want to rethink that outfit. Hey, what's wrong with my outfit? I look like a tree camper.
So the only thing I might change with the rain is um, just lighten it up a little bit. Unless um, we have specific business, I'm not interested. I think I might. I think you do that through maybe the transparency or something. I'm not really sure. Uh, I won't do it now, but um, it's just a, a little bit dark. It, you almost can't see it. So yeah, I just want to um, be able to see it a little bit more through the daytime. But uh, apart from that, it's um, looking pretty cool. Alright. I guess this is where we go. So yeah, obviously um, I have uh, Legacy of the Dragonborn. Um, I've had it for a while actually, but I have never actually played it. Um, I haven't read too much into it either, so I don't really know what to expect, but I know it's good. Um, and yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. And I'm pretty sure I have to go off collecting things um, to fill the uh, exhibitions back up. Uh, but that's all I know. So yeah, I'm excited. Alright, let's do this. Okay, I'm this is the man. Can I help you? The museum is currently closed until further notice. Um, I saw this flyer about you needing treasure hunters. Oh yes, my advertisement. I am looking still, but I do hope you are better than the others I have hired as of late. Oh, no doubt. I have a list of items that I would very much like to have for the museum. If you can recover them, I'll pay you handsomely for them. If you manage to bring them all back here, we could even discuss some other plans I have in mind. Uh, I'll get right on that. Excellent. Well, first and foremost, I'd like to get my hands on one of the Sixth House Bellhammers of the House of Dagoth. They have become increasingly rare. One apparently was stolen recently by some bandits, apparently held up in Broken Helm Hollow. Another item was stolen from a local collector by the Silent Moon Bandits. The item is known as Denstagma's Ring. It's likely still in the hideout west of Whiterun, if they haven't fenced it yet, that is. And lastly, a small shipment of Arkaviri relics is on its way across Skyrim, bound for Markarth. Amongst the items were some jade carvings. The caravan, however, was attacked by Forsworn, and it's likely they may be in possession of some of the relics. Find what you can, and I'll pay you well for it. Okay, we've got some quite a bit to do there. Oh, I really want to go inside. I guess we have to wait. And it's still raining. Alright, what to do first? Uh, broken Helm Hollow. And yeah, that's um <laughs> that's on the other side of the map. So we won't be doing that one just yet. And yeah, that's reasonable. It's not too far away. That's also a reasonable as well. Alright, let's go for the uh, Jade Warrior 2. Uh, I don't think I can get out this way. Nope. Hi there. Do you have a moment? There's something I'd like to ask of you. Um, <coughs> excuse me, uh, what is it? So, my husband and I, we just got married, and... <laughs> oh, I'm so happy! Right now, we need every help we can get to make our new living. I was wondering, just maybe, you're carrying a few things you don't have need for? Maybe a few knives or even dishes? Pots? 
rooms? Anything at all. If you could share something we can make use of, I'd really, really appreciate it. Um... <laughs> Mary Cha, congratulations, I guess. Thank you! I like it. Oh, I'm so happy that Jorik and I are finally together. You yeah, ever heard of the honeymoon stage? <laughs> um, sure. I may have a thing or two you can use. I'm not sure if I do, but... Thank you! Um, would you like these uh, lovely goat horns, maybe? And I've got plenty of deer hides. You could probably have a couple of those. Yeah, two. Snowberry tea. May you be blessed by Lady Mara, as I am. Why, thank you. So you're just gonna stand out here in the rain? Getting wet? I guess so. Unless we have specific business, I'm not interested. Dude, how's the muscles on him? Dude, it's raining. <coughs> I need to go inside. Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. Oh wow, it's nearly 5 pm. You know what? I think we might just crash at the inn tonight and then head out first thing in the morning. Because uh, it's going to be dark pretty soon. Especially seeing as it's overcast. <clears throat> Come on in. Let me know if you need anything. Or take a seat by the fire and I'll send someone over. Well, I actually need a room, so... Welcome to the Winking Skeever, friend. I'd like to rent a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Excellent. I'll show you to your room. Wow, well, uh, thank you. Being old's not so bad. Daughter keeps me fed. My working days are done. Hello, I'm Gizli. But you can just call me Erica's sister. Everyone does. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Okay, we'll do. Thanks, mate. Five thirty. Okay, cool. Um, so we're gonna leave that one there, guys. Um, so next episode, we'll be um, heading out nice and early after the uh, Jade Warrior Two. Um, yeah, um, that's not too far away. And, um, yeah, we'll go from there. So I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll catch you guys in the next one. Cheers. This is an ode to Skyrim's staunch protectors, the Imperials.